This is Super Dale, and I'm back with another video. Now, this video is going to be a little bit, not even a little bit, it's going to be a lot different than what I usually do. Usually, I do the Cody Bills. I tell you about an APK. I show you how to what? Make the box yours. All right? I've been telling you all that for a little bit over a year. And what I mean by making the box yours, you customize the box to your liking. Just like I love this Spider-Man picture, right? So what did I do? I used Nova Launcher and I added this picture, this um, picture of Spider-Man, this artwork to the page because I like it. I made it mine. All right. You could do live wallpapers and everything, water clicking and the water moving, all of that. So I always told you to make the box yours. Now I'm telling you to take your box to the next level. All right. With so many changes going on in Cody add-ons going up and down up and down you got apks going up and down up and down why don't you do it yourself all right what i did i was just going through my little closet over there and i found a hard drive i found a hard drive plugged it up to my computer and i wanted to see what was on it i had a whole bunch of movies tv shows music karaoke some YouTube video, workout video. I had all of that. But then I said, damn, it would be nice if I can share that content over my home network. So after doing some research, I found this application called Plex. Now, it's already installed on my PC right now. It's very easy to set up. Very, 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 very easy to set up. And all I have to do after the setup was plug my um, hard drive, which is a 500 gigabyte hard drive, plugged it into my PC, went it, you know, um, added my content on there, and that was it. So I'm going to just show you, we're going to take the box to the next level using Plex. I'm going to click on Plex right here. All right, it's telling you to sign up, already signed up on my PC, but I'm going to sign up on this box because I just installed Plex on this box. All right, so I'm going to have to blur this out, y'all. Sorry for that, but I have to blur it out. And this is going to be fun. I'm telling you, take your box to the next level. Don't just be stuck with Cody and APKs. Why not... Start your own Netflix, your own Cody, you know what I'm saying? In this way, you don't have to wait on nobody. All right. Oops, sorry about that. Uh, left a few things out. All right. So from here, it'll give you some literature, but of course, this cost because this is um Plex Plus, Plus Pass, I bet, not Plus, Plex Pass. All right, so I'm going to just click not now. All right, come back out. From here, just like on the computer when I installed it, you know, I installed Plex on the computer. It asked me to restart the computer. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to restart my Android TV box. Go through it. That way it get a fresh, you know, um, start. And you can do the same thing. And what I... Hold up. And, and what I noticed that upstairs on two of the boxes that I installed Plex, two of the Android boxes I installed Plex on, um, you know, at first I, it wouldn't work. And so when I um, unplugged the box and plugged it back in, everything worked perfectly. So to save you that headache, after you install Plex on your box, Go ahead and restart your box. But now, before I go into Plex, I want to show you. Oops, I forgot. All right, I'm about to say, man. All right, we're going to go to Plex.tv. And I'm going to show you all the platforms that you need, all the clients that it work on. And when I say clients, I mean devices. NVIDIA Shield, 
Android, Apple. So it works on the Apple. It works on the Android phone, uh, Windows phone. It works on Roku, Apple TV, the NVIDIA Shield. It works on Android TV boxes, Xbox, PlayStation, and the Amazon Fire TV stick or box. So, um, of course, it'll give a video right there, but you know you can you can it's just easy as one two three you sign up download add your media just like i did I, I just plug my hard drive up and then you can stream it to your through you can stream it through your home network all right whether you on wi-fi or you have it plugged directly in all right so it's pretty pretty cool 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 <laughs> pretty pretty all right, so now let's go into my Plex so I can show you all a little bit how to take your box to the next level. All right, so it's going to tell you a little bit about it. It tells you your name. Um, and then it tells you the menu. This is the navigation menu right here, which I'm going to show you. And then it's going to talk about Chrome. You can actually um, cast this out. Not Chrome, but you can cast this out to your device if you want. But there's really no need for that. So you could just hit OK, got it. And right now it just shows the last video I was playing. Me and my wife, we was upstairs, uh, you know, messing around and stuff, dancing and stuff like that. So let me go to the, navig the navigation menu. All right. So it got playlist channels, which I don't have any other channels, but you can install some channels um, on here. But I do have my own karaoke. I do have movies. I do have my music. I got some prank calls and stuff like that. Uh, sports section, TV shows, workout videos, and YouTube. So I'm going to just start it off showing you my karaoke. This is my library that I set up on the PC. And this is, is giving me that content on all my devices. So look, if I wanted to go to karaoke, even though I can't, but I do have a lot of karaoke. All right, I could just hit browse. And as you see, everything from Beyonce, Bobby Brown, look at Bobby Brown, rock with you, uh, Bobby Womack, Boys the Man. I have so much karaoke, uh, Shaka Khan. I have a lot, a lot of content. So, you know, I mean, it's fun. So when family and friends come over, shoot, you can forget bringing out that machine. You got your karaoke right here. The Commodores, Chris Brown, Sierra, all of that. All right, so if I go up here to my navigation menu, I can go to movies. All right, so what I can do is hit browse, which is already on here, and it shows you all my collection, all my movie collection, and I have a lot. I got to take this out because this is the fight that need to be, that need to be in my sports. All right. So look at all this content. And the thing about it, it finds the um, poster art for you. All right. It finds that for you. Look at this. And that's all you need. So like say if uh, a movie at the theaters come out today, right? And it's a real good coffee. You like, dang, I got to get that. I, got, I, I need that. I need that. Like my boy Bo say, I need that. Hey. You get it. I don't care how you get it. If you download it, somebody give it to you, take it, put it onto your um, hard drive, and there you have it. But look, all of this. I even got Def Comedy Jam on here. What I'm going to do, I'm going to break this up, though. I'm going to break it up with comedy. Um, I'm going to have, that's going to have its own library. Um, the Kids, this was a good movie right here, Fracture. If you don't know about that, you got to watch Fracture. Fracture was a excellent movie great movie um but yeah this is my whole library of my movies i'm gonna put the horror section in here and you you basically making your own cody but it's yours all right it's yours you ain't got to go and search or nothing like that you know when it come out on cody somehow you can get it if you want to take a risk and download it you can um it's ways to get the content let's just say that and then you can add it to your home network. That way you don't even need to go on the Cody and watch it. All right. So if I wanted to watch, uh, let me see, Love and Basketball, 
I just click on it. Of course, it tells me what it's about. You know, I can hit more. And then all you have to do is hit play. Look at that. And then watch it start up. Look at that. Look at that. So of course this movie is kind of old for me, so I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to really do some stuff, y'all. Uh, I can go back, and you know it, it's just that easy. If I want to watch uh, Avatar, just click it. It's gonna load it, telling me what it is, you know, giving me the ratings, and then just hit play. see so i mean it's real real nice uh let me go here i got my music of course i can't play any music all right i can't play and it brings up the art poster the the cover or whatever got that so that's pretty cool uh sports when um mayweather and uh kodo i can just click on it and then just hit play. Look at that. Starts right on up. I can go move fast forward it. Look at that. So pretty, pretty cool, y'all. Ain't nothing like having your own. I got TV shows. You know, there's only a few of them. But it will be changing. I'll tell you that. Workout videos. I got Insanity. And when you go to Insanity, of course, it tells you you got 14 episodes. You click on it, and you can go to all your episodes. Pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. I hit back. I can go to the... And then I got some YouTube stuff on here. Some stuff. You know, the Cypher BT. This is 2011. Um, um, Aaron, what's her name? Ann Wolf knocking out old girl in boxing. You know, Michael Myers ping pong. My boy, Mr. Smooth, who show you how to ballroom. Y'all y'all don't know nothing about that. Getting your girl out there and dancing with her. All right. So he, he a cool guy right there. So, uh, yeah, you got a whole lot, just a whole lot of content. So, look, not only am I teaching you how to make the box yours, I'm telling you, you if you mess with me, you're going to take your box to the next level. Why don't you do it yourself? Build your own library using Plex, all right? Greatest thing, it's nice, it works. You see how fast it is. Ain't nothing like being able to just leave that thing plugged up into your computer. And if you got a box in the basement, you got a box in your bedroom, a box in your living room, a box in your bathroom, just being in there, just click the play button, just scroll down to wherever you want. You want to listen to some music? You can, but just scroll on down to wherever you want and you can get click, bleh, click play. All right. Of course, it have parental controls on it, too. I didn't get in depth, but later this week, hopefully I get into it. I, I ain't going to say get into it. I hope to start a video from start to finish on connecting it to your PC all the way to your Android box, which you already pretty much seen the Android box, but we'll go from A to Z. That way you can take charge and um, begin the stages of taking your box to the next level. You don't have to just keep waiting on Cody, Cody, Cody and stuff like that. You can you can do it, um, you know, really, really, really take that box to the next level. All right. I forgot what I was about to say, but it's all good. Hey, please like, share, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Greatly appreciate it. I'm telling you, we're going to have some fun with this one. Too many people are not going to teach you this, y'all. They're not going to teach you this. All right, so click that like button, y'all. If you like it, share it. Show people what this channel is all about. It's not just about Cody, and it's not just about these applications with which we call APKs to watch your movies. You can do a whole lot with these boxes. All right. Talk to y'all later. Don't forget, subscribe, like, share that video. And you better smack that like button. Smack it, back smack it, and smack it again. I'll talk to y'all later. Peace.